Welcome back. We're here looking at the NG market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Thursday, July 21st, 2022. If you'd like to support the channel, you're going to hit the subscribe button down in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos and all my trades and portfolio are available in the link down below. So let's look at WTI oil. And yes, we did fall uh, to uh, 89, uh, 98, sorry, uh, dollars per barrel, and we ended up at 99 dollars per barrel. So Nothing really happened here today. A little bit of bearishness, but nothing is significant. We are still in this bearish channel here, and we are getting very close to the upper part of the channel. 20 simple moving average is right here, and as you can see right there, and also here, that has been an area uh, where we have found massive resistance. So it may well be that we will go head towards the 20 simple moving average and then break to the downside. Um, it's earnings season and companies are doing fairly better than expected but out, uh, outlook for the world economy is still uh, not really good and of course that uh, has an effect on uh, the demand for oil uh, which we have seen recently we have dropped all the way from $123 a barrel and went all the way down towards $90 per barrel um, but if we break above the 20 simple moving average, then the 50 moving average will mostly come into play, which is $109. If you look at MACD, it is about to become uh, cross the signal and becoming bullish in negative territory. Stochastic is about to become bearish and the RSI is about to become bearish. So a little bit uh, mixed picture in, in the technical indicators. But if this holds, then it's most likely that will basically break to the downside. So let's look at natural gas. This was an absolute um, uh, bombshell today as it broke way above the 50 moving average and also uh, the Fibonacci 50 Fibonacci, uh, retracement. Yes, you can look here. We had uh, 0 0.5 at uh, $7.5 uh, uh, and we also have the 50 moving average right here. So this was an area of massive resistance and we just completely crushed it and went all the way up to 61.8 which is around $8 and then we pulled back. So it's a fairly big pullback. We were up more than 10% on the day and ended up at 8.27%. Um, percent a massive move to the upside uh, if we manage to break above here then we are mostly going to go back to the very highs but as we pull back from uh, eight dollars and um, uh, 61.8 Fibonacci retracement it may well be that this was basically the top usually it is is where we rally and then basically uh, pull back to the downside and go significantly lower this could be a uh, bearish flag pattern and if so then we are looking at a massive move all the way down to roughly four dollars but breaking above here then it will be more like a v-shaped recovery after that if we look at technical indicators they do favor the upside as we have rallied significantly from the 200 moving average uh, we can see the macd is bullish stochastic is bullish and the rsi is also bullish at 61 in the daily which means there's a lot of room to the upside still before we get overbought. So, hope you find this helpful. You're willing to support the channel by subscribing, hit the like button, the bell button, see our news videos. Good luck and thank you very much.